Morning, it's the start of a new week, it's a Monday, let's get on with it. I've got a client this morning, I'm gonna do a session, it's a new one, and I'll speak to you guys after. Let's go. I've just spent the last hour and a half getting a load of videos for client online programs, and this is what it looks like. I've got a lot of exercises. My head hurts a little bit. It was hot and didn't drink much water. So I need to drink more of that ASAP. Probably get some food because I'm absolutely hungers. Yes, I'm hungers. So hungers. And I need to do a lot more online stuff. So again, Mondays are a bit on the boring side for you guys anyway. But I'm still showing you what I'm doing, okay? So Mondays, you're probably going to get a short bit of the video, but then Tuesdays, Wednesdays, it's when the magic happens, you know, when it's like, boom, stuff. I've got my hair cut. I just need to go obviously clean it and sort it out and style it. We've got the fade in. I love it. I don't feel scruffy, but I have a lot of product in my hair already. So this is what it looks like that. I'm absolutely boiling. I'm sweating. I need to take this off in this heat. It's just... Where are the hay fever tablets? Here we go. Any of you guys really suffering from hay fever this summer? Because I am right now, and my nose is itching so much. I get it all in my eyes. They're not too bad this year round, but for some weird reason, my nose just tingles all the time, and I'm getting it a lot in my throat, which is irritating. It's annoying. But you know what? You've got to just deal with it, haven't you? Stuff like that happens. But right now, Mondays are admin days, so I'm not going to bore you with all my admin stuff because you've seen that enough already. So what I'll do is I'll catch up with you guys a little bit later when my day gets a bit more interesting. So in this like two second gap, which would have been quite a lot of the day, I want you to smash your goals. I want you to just do something you've always wanted to do. Finish the day up with two clients in the evenings. They're both my cousins and it's great because I've been around them ever since I was younger as growing up and they've both got kids now so I don't get to see them as much as I would like. So training them definitely helps and it's good to catch up with them. Uh, business guys is going really well. It's getting a lot of attraction. I'm getting a lot of people ask and want to get involved. It's quite overwhelming because I'm in a good way, I'm busy, right? I am busy. But because of my organisation skills, and they're not the best like you all know, I struggle with a lot of things. I'm quite stressed out at the moment. But stress is the inability to manage your time correctly. And that is me. So, you know, it's life. It happens. It's half past 12. Can't really sleep. Just like... Thinking a lot of stuff. I just finished watching Christian's... Christian Guzman's finale to Summer Shredding really got me thinking. Like, just one guy has been able to create such a big community. It was crazy. Like, it was crazy. And it literally just made me think. It was like... I want to do that. gonna do that mad like it actually it got to me it was just like everything I do day in day out love my job love helping people that's all I want to do is help people I just want to do it on a big big scale I really want to be able to help so many I have ideas of things I want to do. I'm not going to talk about it because they're just ideas at the moment. But oh man, <sighs> I'm 20 years old. But there's so many things, man. There's so many things. No, just one of those, one of those moods. And 
It is the next day. It's currently Wednesday. I didn't film much on the Monday. I didn't film much on the Tuesday. And now it's Wednesday. I'm going to keep filming the rest of this week. And we're going to get two videos up. So there would have been one uploaded today, which you would have hopefully already seen. If you haven't, go back. It's the one before this. So I hope you enjoy it. And I hope that you like it. And today, I have a couple of clients. I have a lot of work to do. We're gonna make this fun, we're gonna make this enjoyable. I do have a family thing I need to go to a little bit later, which will take up a fair bit of the day. But I'll get as much filmed uh, throughout my day as I can. It has just been very hectic with a load of things on the back end going on. But you know what, it doesn't matter. I just got to work on my prioritizing and get shit in order. And I'm just gonna be honest, like I didn't wanna slip off the whole YouTube thing because I did the 12 week cut and it was three videos a week. But I just felt like I wasn't burning myself out. I just realized I, w I need to put my time into things that will allow me to do more videos in the long run, if that makes sense. Because I've been doing a lot on my phone, which isn't bad at all. I just, I've been needing to get that lens. And I'm hoping, because I'm in a position, and I literally can't believe it because I'm feeling great for it, I can generally get one uh, at the end of this month. And before I was like, no, I can get one, I can get one something would come up and then I'd have to pay for something. Whereas now I'm in a position where I'm like, I can generally get one and keep bringing, blah, blah, keep bringing the vlogs, keep bringing some fun, entertaining videos. Because if I'm honest, I've realized, you know, you've got to understand what your goal is and where you want to do things. And I don't want to do the typical scientific videos where like people get bored of, right? I want to bring that, I still want to do them, but with my personality, my twist on it, sort of like my edu entertaining side, which if you've been following my Instagram, you would have seen I've been doing little, like I wouldn't call them skits or anything. I don't know if you'd call it that, maybe. But incorporating that with training um, methods and exercises that you can do, which I think is pretty cool. So yeah, gotta get on with the day. And I hope that you guys are smashing yours too. Back to work I go. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm in a position now where I really want to take SNF and forward more. I have some plans in the work I'm just not gonna talk about. But I don't know. I feel like I need to move on a little bit. Love it here, but I've got a lot of planning. I've got a lot of thinking to do. Something might have to change very soon. It's the next day. I didn't film the rest of yesterday. As it was a bit of a weird day, uh, feelings wise, but it's okay. I'm feeling better today. I just this week I've been very like tired. I felt very lethargic. Last week was very busy for me and it definitely did take it out of me. My sleeping pattern's been on and off, which is annoying because I have just been feeling really, really tired. But it's been one of those weeks where a lot of stuff builds up. I'm just thinking, trying to plan some stuff. Uh, try not to let things get the better of you, which happens sometimes to all of us. We're human. It's just how you deal with it. And I feel like recently, uh, I haven't let it get on top of me. It's just been frustrating at times, just mentally dealing with myself because we are all our own worst enemy sometimes. Whereas right now, I just feel like I'm... I'm in a routine which is great. I just feel like, with regards to YouTube, I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm boring. Like my video last time, um, the other one was like, the reason why I'm getting no views because my videos are shit. I just feel like I'm so focused on the business and doing other stuff that again, I don't, I don't want YouTube to take a backseat. I've already said this because it's very valuable. It really gets. Uh, me out there to people. I need to keep putting content out there. Otherwise, if I don't, then people aren't going to know about the brand. They're not going to know about me. And I want to be able to inspire as many of you guys as I can. It is, I'm not going to lie to you, when it's just yourself, it is difficult. Because when you don't have the money to pay for videographers and things like that, you have to do everything yourself, which is fine. You know, you've got to make do of the things that you have. But it's not easy because you're trying to put everything onto different platforms, run a business, you don't want to spread yourself too thin. And I feel like I have been in the last couple of weeks that it's kind of got to me, which I knew it would. That's why when things like this happen, I tend to try and cool down a little bit and not let it get too much. Because I know my body now, before I would have run myself into the ground and I would have taken like a week or two off. And I don't want to be like that person again. I want to keep being consistent and find better ways to just get content out to you guys. So let's start the day. I don't know how long this video is going to be, uh, but you know, it's okay. I 
I've eaten breakfast. I had an omelette with chicken in it. I'm looking the door. I took my shirt off because my house was geared in boiling. Now I need to put it back on. And I have two clients. I've got my cousins who want to get in shape, who want to get fit. One of my cousins is getting married. So we're trying to get her uh, in shape for her wedding, which is quite cool because like I said beforehand, I don't see them um, as much as I used to when I was younger. So it's good time that we have and we spend together. And yeah, it's nice to kind of help your family out, get fit, because sometimes when you, when you go to help your family out, because they're always there, I don't know if you guys get this, it's like, yeah, no, I'll help you out, and then you don't. I don't know if that's the same with everyone. It might just be me, um, just because I'm busy, uh, and you think, oh, I'll see you all the time, it'll be fine. Whereas now it's just, a, I make it a priority. Like, I want to get more family members down here, and what's going to be good is I don't really want to talk too much about it, but I want to put an event on, I want to put a circuit on uh, that can have loads of people come down, it'll be free, uh, put on like a circuit class that everyone can attend, uh, there'll be a limit, I think maybe like 60 people or something, maybe, I don't know, which would be quite cool and I'm excited because I've always wanted to do that and I feel like I'm in a position now where I have the confidence and I could do that. I want to just put myself in uncomfortable situations, guys. Like, I say this to you guys all the time, I want to be able to mess up, which I will so many times, but I want to be able to put myself in a situation where I'm like, I really don't want to do this now. Well, not I don't want to do it. Like, oh, did I make a mistake? Oh, ah. But then you know, yeah, you probably might have or you're going to, but you're going to learn. So let's go and set up. Let's go and do this circuit class with my clients. I'm just feeling good today, guys. I'm feeling pretty damn good. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Oh, it's a nice day, it's hot. I still need to invest in getting a new top because I'm absolutely behoiling. Ugh, I've been suffering from headaches. I don't know if that's just because my eyes are straining because of the light or I just generally haven't been drinking enough water. It's probably a combination of the two. So guys, make sure you drink your water. I'm trying to set an example, but sometimes you forget. As you can see here, we're getting a lot of building work done. They're extending this out. I think they're turning that into a reception area. I'm not 100% sure. The gym is located in that door just there. It's a box gym, it's really good. So you come out, there's a few things that you can do outside. They are now getting a AstroTurf, which is here, so we can do sleds, we can do a load of different things on here. And obviously you've got the rugby pitch itself, which we can do a load of stuff on. Anyway, because the weather is amazing. So there's a lot currently going on here, which is amazing. We are actually going to be doing the gym back up soon. So we're going to be putting liquor paint on the walls as there are low marks. I'm not sure what color they're going to go. I think they still will be white, maybe black. I don't, I'm not too sure if it's black, you know, definitely might go with this, but I'm not hundred percent sure. But after, this, uh, after my clients today, I'm going to be training, not in here. I think I'm going to go to the Tara Center, change it up geared a couple of different angles as like i enjoy training in here but at the same time like i said to you i like switching things up and i want to go and do a bit more sort of probably bodybuilding style actually because i mentioned it yesterday in one of my stories and it made me think i was like you know what i actually missed doing one of those workouts i'm probably gonna go and do it and then do like 20 minutes or something on the stairmaster because i've also missed the stairmaster and I feel like since the cut that I've done, I put a little bit back on, which I'm not bothered about as such, but I do miss the Stairmaster. I just think I've been so caught up with everything in here. Uh, I've neglected um, some of the things that I do really enjoy as well with my training. Um, but again, I've been trying a lot of different things, but I do want to kind of get back to some of the stuff that I was doing before, if that makes sense. Change of plan. I think I'm actually going to take the circuit outside as you can see look look the weather is well can you see it the weather is lovely sun's out and my clients were training here last time so i think we're gonna do exactly the same oh no you wouldn't believe what i've just done i've gone and set everything up over there i didn't bring my key with me 
And now the door's locked. No! Oh shit. Is anyone in? Oh. That's so, oh, that's not good. Oh no, 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 no. How long have I got? I've got 20 minutes. It's okay, the door was open, so I'm good. I panicked for a second then. You need to make sure if your door's ever like that when you go to a gym, you bring a key, okay? You bring a key. I was lucky, because this door was open. In the lift, going up, my hair is sticking out. I'm about to do a push session, my phone's about to die, so I'm gonna get as many clips as I can. Look at this. I'm not gonna lie, it does feel good to be back in here training. As you know, when you get used to going to like a certain gym, uh, and I just want to keep switching up, enjoying myself, and I'm looking forward to seeing what I can do on bench today as that's like the only movement I really enjoy doing and I always have. Starting off a bench press, first set, I'm on 100, I may go up, I felt a light twinge in my elbow, not too bad. I'm going to try and attempt maybe three to five reps, we'll see how I go. Maybe I'm gonna do six instead, so I'm pretty happy with that. I can't see my glasses, because I've got sweat all over them. Still can't really see, but that was a pretty decent session. I enjoyed that. It was nice to get a bit of bodybuilding work back in. Hypertrophy rep ranges. Stairmaster, absolutely sweat went out. Perfect start to the day. Now, like your boy does every single day, he's gonna go home, he's gonna have some food, then he's gonna edit up some content for the socials, because that's his life. He's gonna update clients, he's gonna do check-ins, he's gonna see how they are, how their week's been going, what the program's like for them, if it needs changing or whatever. So, loving it, got a great circuit for tonight, and I gotta get planning because I got some news, okay? I got some really good news. I've had the circuit confirmed, which means I am allowed to put on a circuit on the rugby club field. It's gonna be free to the public, and I want at least 60 people, minimum. I reckon I can do it. I have three weeks, so I need to get on it as soon as possible. And I'm gonna start it today. So if you're watching this and you want to come, comment down below. I wanna come to the circuit. There'll be a link in future videos in the description box about how you can sign up because you'll need to sign a form, obviously with like injuries and a consent form and things like that, just to make sure that like, uh, I, I don't get sued if you hurt yourself. Yeah, basically. So, 
what a start to the day. I'm feeling amazing, I'm feeling pumped. Boom.